It is the 31st of August 2007. I am in a car with the lovely Julie Gardner. Hello, here, here I am. There you are. Being driven by uh, the equally lovely Kevin. There oh, he is. hi. Um, <laughs> and uh, where are we now, Kevin? Uh, we're in. Staffordshire. We're in trouble. <laughs> Staffordshire. Well, we're, why are we in trouble, Julie? We're in trouble, David, because we're going to Blackpool to turn on the illuminations. When I say we, I mean you. Yeah. I'm there to hold your bag. Sure. Uh, and we left Cardiff slightly late because we were locking the special effects of the Christmas episode, Christmas 07. And I was filming Planet Viewed. And you were filming Planet Viewed. Yeah. And what time, did, what time did we leave? We left at 20 to 3. Yeah. It is now quarter to 5. We are past Birmingham, but there's a massive pile-up. And so we're in a little bit of a pickle. Mm. And I think we're at about Junction 12. And the exciting news is if, if we're really, really late, by the time we get to Junction 29, we will be able to have a police escort to get us in because Blackpool City Council is very worried that you won't be there to turn on the lights. But you sort of want us to get stuck because you want the police escort, I am you? really... I'm only here for the police escort. Yeah. I'm not remotely interested in the lights or you turning them on. Uh, but I really want the Miami Vice moment. Yeah. I'm quite interested in meeting Natalie Imbruglia. Yes. Uh, who's also playing tonight. We're now moving quite smoothly though, Kevin. We've picked up a bit of pace since I turned the camera on. Or the pace, yeah. We may not get to see the blue flashing lights, unfortunately. No, I'm sorry, Julie. If I can help it, you won't get it. Um. <laughs> it's now five o'clock, exactly. We're supposed to be there in two hours. What's the sat nav predicting now, Kev? It's predicting 20 to 7. Oh, well, that's very still promising. Mind you, here comes a traffic jam. God, it doesn't look good out there. It's not good out there. I'm going to phone Phil now. Should we find out where Phil is? Yeah. He's going to be in trouble, isn't he? Because he's going to be way back. I do think he's going to Phil Collins and our producer was still at uh, the unit base outside Cardiff at three o'clock. He's not going to get here at all, is he? I wouldn't have thought so. Hey, I think you're in trouble because we're in trouble. There's a massive uh, snarl up of traffic. Um, whereabouts on the M5 are you? He's just joined the M5. Is that bad? Just joined the M5. That's very bad. OK, you're in very bad shape, apparently. <laughs> so hold on, I'm just, I'm just putting you on speakerphone so David could ask you a question for the diary. Hold on. What am I asking him? Hello. Hi. Hello. Hello, how are you? I'm, I'm, I'm all right. I'm not sure whether I'm going to make it because I'm going very slow on the M5 and I'm not long on the M5 because there was a hideous accident outside Cardiff. Hello. And they're all with it. Whenever I get in my car, what, what's going on? <laughs> and how are you feeling now we've announced that the end is in sight? Well, well, very weird. It was a really weird thing to be sat there saying, actually, because, of course, you know, I, know, um, I know how kind of... Uh, I'm not really going to be involved in that, so it, it felt very strange, I have to say. Mm. Uh, and, and a real kind of... I don't know, it's not going to be easy to drive away from, but there you go. <laughs> yeah. We'll see you later. I'll keep in touch, yeah? Bye. Bye. Stop to ring me if you get blue passing lights. OK, we will. We will, we'll film it. Bye, bye, bye. The report just said basically 18 to 20 on the M6 is completely and utterly at a standstill. That's where we are now, right? That's where we are now. And then the bit where we've got to really go is from junction 28 to 32. They reckon it's going to take you an hour and a half to drive that little bit. So we are in deep, deep trouble. Julie, what just happened? It was really exciting, uh, David. Graham phoned me from, on, on this phone, Graham phoned me from the Blackpool Police Service uh, to give me instructions on how we're now going to be police escorted into Blackpool. I think the issue is that uh, the traffic is going to build up uh, going into Blackpool because so many people... Because the motorway is actually clear now, despite yeah, the traffic right. reports. We're actually ro racing it now. But essentially, the, the, the instructions are to drive for six miles. We then approach...
approach a junction, there will be two motorcyclists placed strategically on top of the bridge and we are going to flash our lights at them and then they are going to escort us in. Is this a disgusting waste of, poli waste of police resources? Um, I don't believe it is, David. Shouldn't they be out catching muggers? Uh, I think they're doing that as well. Are they? Okay. Yeah, good. I believe I believe in Graham we just phoned because Graham was very sensible. Yeah, sure. And I think I think clearly he doesn't want to have a riot on his hands on Blackpool seafront when you don't arrive and Dale Winton has to turn on the lights without you. We, we did get a message that Natalie and Brulia's band had been escorted in via Preston, didn't we? Yes, we did. So obviously there have been problems today, but maybe now because we're a bit late, they're, 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 well certainly this motorway is deserted. We're about to turn off. Is that right, Kevin? That's correct, yes. We've, um, Are you excited about the police escort? Definitely not. No? <laughs> no, no. You seem slightly nervous. Have you got something to be... <laughs> <laughs> no, not, not at all. Kevin, why are you not excited about the police escort? Uh, I just... Don't you want to be starting in Hutch, Miami Vice? Definitely not. I'd rather be low-key. Yeah. Uh, well, welcome to our band. We're <laughs> taking you in. And like you're, you're like your Crockett and Tubbs. I'm, I'm 007. I do it undercover. Oh. Yeah. Oh, right, OK. I, I think... I think we should be flashing. Let's go for the flash. <laughs> well, we've got to. We've been told to by the blooming yeah. police now. Yeah, but Kevin, Kevin could sabotage it. By not flashing? Because Kevin has to flash. If Kevin doesn't flash, we're going to miss our police escort, so he might actually scupper the whole no, thing. Don't, don't do it, Kevin. It means too much to Julie. No, She's foaming in the mouth back here. There they are! Police <laughs> dogs! Police dogs! Maybe they're there for us as well. It's a fan of police dogs, not, not actually any police. Two camera unit. <laughs> we are. Julie's We're on double her phone. banking. Yeah. We're double banking. This is it. I'm second unit. I think if you see camera. the two the little bulge up there, I think that's the police officers on top of the bridge. You can but just see it. Kevin, are, are, are you getting are you getting ready to flash? I'm getting ready to flash. There they are. There they are on the bridge. <laughs> oh, I can't even focus. There they are. You think you think I've got problems on my phone? Are they seeing us? Are we flashing? Yeah. Do we think Are they flashing the back? No, they've uh, they got us. They got us! They're genius. There they are, they're waving at <laughs> us! Hello! <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're gone in a flash! They're off oh the bridge! God. Are they there? They're off oh, the bridge, they're, they're coming to meet us! Oh. Look at this. Escorted down a completely empty road, though it, it doesn't feel like it's quite yeah, yeah, necessary. No, no, Graham says there are 10,000 people there, David. Oh, I see. Once we get into yeah, the actual Blackfields, yeah. I'm phoning Russell. <laughs> <laughs> I'm phoning everyone I know. Look at this! Oh, we're passing a sign for illuminations. David, oh, I missed it. I David, missed it. David clearly can't speak because he thinks he's Michael Mann here. <laughs> Flashing lights. <laughs> I think the illuminations have begun. <laughs> oh my god, Beth. That is completely mental. So, so Dave is taking photos uh, uh, with, his, with his video camera, and I'm taking photos for you with my phone. So we are a two-man two crew. Yeah, I'm second unit. Brilliant. Is that a siren? Did I just hear a siren? You did. Oh yes, the sirens are now going. God, the sirens. It's blues and twos. Ah! Oh, we, we just went through a red light. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we went through a red light. There is so no need for this. The roads are empty. 